Welcome back to another Real Talk Reaction. This one is for Harley Quinn, Season 2, Episode Number 3. Yes, just one comment to feature from Episode 2, Executive Producer Lisset says, Love the reaction, guys. MVP of this episode was Clayface. Totally agree. Yeah. Also, Barbara Gordon is the daughter, and she shares a first name with her mother, and she is the Batgirl, not Catwoman. Okay. So, thanks I for the clarifying. I thought it was either one. One or the other. So, thanks for clarifying that. Let's that get into Episode me. 3 right now. 3, 2, Successful. Come on! We can't get into Mr. Freeze's territory, so why not we just let him keep it, alright? Because he froze my living body! Then put me on display for my ex- They're dumping toxic waste into the harbor? I gotta stop these assholes! That happened like two weeks ago. It did? Yeah. How did I miss that? Well, it certainly wasn't because you were attending my one-man performance of Joe Didion's The Year of Magical Thinking. Ah, we He's no Vanessa. Dr. Trapp's diary. Sorry, wait, who's Dr. Trapp? Oh my god! Dude, he's the guy that looted all the villain's lairs when the city fell. He's got a whole collection of powerful crap at the Gotham Natural History Museum. They're, they're giving everything away right now. Fire gun. Oh my. Shit. Thanks for all your help. Text us if you think of anything else. Right. <laughs> Don't Give us all the information. Baby measures my. so cute. I know me too, right? They are so booed up, baby. Thanks for the ride, babe. Good job, babe. Turns out in a post-apocalyptic world, kites are pretty crucial. You know, you don't have to say that every time you drop us off, okay? I packed you a high-protein snack for long life. You're branching out from only caring about things with branches. You gotta get out there. Just play the field. You're the new poison ivy. You don't have to commit to the first guy who's nice to you. Uh, your ex-boyfriend tried to kill you several times. It was an inside joke. Maybe you just don't know what it's like to be treated well by someone who truly loves you. Oh, no, I've got smashing blue balls. Come, please, into the bear of that you trap. I dare you. Ooh, I dare. Sorry, are, are you Dr. Trap or is that your boss? Actually, it doesn't even matter. Just tell him that we want no trouble and we're just here to grab Firefly's flamethrower and then we're going to be on our way. The treasure is all yours if you can best my trap. <laughs> Like overkill. That's overkill. <laughs> I'd love to find a way to do this without being. Really? If you wanted to do an evil collab, you should have invited me to join the Injustice League and given me my own damn slice of this set. <laughs> you and me in the same boardroom. No wonder those mangy curs are laughing at you. You listen to me, butt face. I was a few. <gasps> oh no! My people mind you. You have been drinking it! Psych! You can't control my mind. I'm an A-lister. I'm too smart. And you're just a weak, washed up goon. Mm. <laughs> oh, really? Can a goon give you a makeover? <laughs> He's pushing all his buttons, babe. Oh, I hate this place. When I go for lunch, I want a meal, not a grouping of sides. And I want that flamethrower, not a spike through my head from Dr. Gitalite. So, I called the best burglar at all Gotham, and this is where they wanted to meet. Wait, why'd you say that? It's Catwoman, hasn't it? Are you excited? Ah, your good friends reunited for a heist? Ah, I need three badass ladies taking down that sore blood diamond, leaving me to pay for the entire hotel bill. Hi, yeah. okay. What, this? Oh, yeah, the, I, I was thinking about <laughs> donating it. I think it's just like this apple's gotten so trendy. You know? Kind of salads all around. Oh, see, she always does this. She orders for everything. So I'm in. So I'm in. Wow, just like that? Do you really like this jacket or would you say me? <laughs> oh, man. What's happening? Actually, the truth is, we're just not comfortable working together. Ah, oh, this is so. I, she just stole your favorite jacket. I know, but it looks so much better on her. Oh my god! <laughs> Mm -hmm. Is she always late? Yes, it is a power move. Well, it's not even original. I've been stood up by batter asses. Here, kitty kitty! Oh, always this impetuous. Give me a dictionary and I'll tell you. A chauffeur. Give me a dictionary and I'll tell you. He's my boyfriend. Can I come in? Oh, no. My biggest fear is traps and space. No kites in space there, so. I'm gonna hang back, keep watch, maybe pick up some nice coffee. It's pretty strong female anti- Ah, oh, it's our signature move. <laughs> I'm in shape like a leaf in there that'll make the perfect engagement ring for Ivy. She loves stuff with leaves. Are you sure Ivy wants to take this next step with you? Maybe take a lesson from the slow cooker and let that shit simmer, huh? No way! 
Our love is cooked to perfection. Cooked so, to perfection. traps be damned. I'm getting a diamond armory exhibit. Ooh, bet they have some sick arrowheads. Love to peep those babies if we have time. Follow me. Yeah, the peep those babies if we have time. If herein lies my lady's diamond, then totes. Works for me. Yeah. <laughs> Survive my first trap. That wasn't a trap, that was a pencil. Survive my first trap. <laughs> You have a boyfriend, huh? Rolling him like we did those loggers. Fuck, I bet they have the flamethrower and they're waiting for us outside. No, this may come as a shock, but I could never do better tonight. I know. You know, she pretends to hate everyone, but under that, I've never known a more supportive, understanding, caring, and funny woman who can control plants. She deserves I could run a crew. You've seen what my brain is capable of. They don't get me. What I don't get is why you need validation from me. That's a, just a weak mind. You're just a crazy hair, weak minded <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> Riddler is missing. Ha <laughs> ha! will be most displeased. Displeased? She's gonna fucking kill me! This was the one thing she told me to do! That, of course, is feed the koi in the fountain. But I bred and fried those fuckers. It's amazing how good you are at running a crew. Ha <laughs> ha There's no reason to freak out over a lost prisoner. Unless no. you built a rapport in order to gain their trust to break them, and in the process, they've broken you. I guess right. In King Shark, you take the fountains and bathrooms. Clayface, take the ground floor. I'm gonna supervise over walkie-talkies, which is the hardest and most leadership-heavy part of a split. That's right. It's the hardest and most... Leadership part. I don't know how you live this way. Yeah, I mean, I guess it just sort of happened, but, you know, I mean... Oh no, I'm good. Oh my god, what's wrong with your face? Oh, bad reaction to my new deodorant, babe. Back to the chemical stuff. What? Oh. Will you do me the honor? Oh. Where's my ring? Got a gun. Girl power and all of that. Wow, oh. what a cold beat. Mm -hmm. What a cold thank you. Exit to the gift shop. Not wait, that's your real voice? Yes, we see what your voice sounds like when you survive. And he's a fuck. I'm down and he can't have gotten fucked. And he's got a walkie talkie. <gasps> Over. And for. I'm down for this. I'm taking all of you with me. Yeah, you are, uh, you little man. There's the. Yourself. I mean, there's something said for not getting smushed to death. I'm messing this We're up. We're only here because of her. No, no, no. We're here because of your stupid fire gun. That probably won't even work. It's a plasma flamethrower, and it can melt any. Oh, duh. I love this shit. Oh, duh. It's because I don't even know what's move time. I don't know if it'll ever be the right time. I don't know if I ever want to get married, okay? Damn it. That would have been great for a trip. No, 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 there's no need to keep interacting. You beat my traps. You're free to go. You can kill. Did you get the gun? Yep, this will burn down Freeze's wall. And why does it look like you guys had a harder night than me? Because we did. Uh, fine, you broke me. Riddler's on the loose. We can't find him. <laughs> you broke, broke me. me. What, you lost Riddler? He's a schmuck. I told him. I don't know why he's on the crew. Okay, let's go. I don't know why he's on the crew. <laughs> And this wouldn't have happened. May I recommend the babysitters club? The series that focused on Stacy's diabetes was so moving. Oh bullshit! You made me a glorified mall cop. I am trying to take down the Injustice League here. I don't have time to recapture my prisoners. Your boy's an idiot. My life. Plus, there's free entertainment. Watching you idiots fail to accomplish even the simplest of tasks. He just came God, back. Guy, what is this fucking Candyland? Wow. Hey, what are you up to? You know, just getting up in touch with my roots. Stopping her from doing what she wants, like punishing Ace Chemicals board of directors for illegal dumping of toxic waste. You know, when I met Kite Man, I thought he was a total dweeb who didn't even deserve to breathe the same air as you. Yeah, me too. Then he started hanging around more, <coughs> and I'm never gonna be Catwoman because you have people that love you. People she is the melting the fuck out of his face right there. People help you with your goals <laughs> if you let them. Can I be one? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> the music is so it's stark contrast to the violence that's going on. You don't have to. Time is good with me. No fresh. But 
If you wanted to ask me again... Ah, I get it. You're not ready. And you know what? Maybe I'm not ready. Now's good. You sure? Because I can't do this a fourth time. I'm ready. Ask me. Aww. All right, that was episode three of Harley Quinn and another endearing episode right there. I like that with Kite Man and, and Ivy. I didn't like the fact that Ivy turns into a two-faced person when Catwoman comes around. It's, it's totally not like her character normally. She's, su she's super confident and, and, and cool all the time and rational. And then Catwoman comes around, she just turns to Putty, which, okay, I get that part. Catwoman is an A-lister, you know, um, um, a threat, but still. I didn't like that part, but it was funny at the same time to see how it played out. Um, I also like the Trap Man traps. He has some good traps over there. It was just a, it was just a cool episode on there, man. And I, I, it was funny that the Riddler came back, too, at the end. He didn't want to go back out there because it's just a hell on earth out there. So, And I also like that Harley's still trying to kill everybody in the Injustice League, and she's probably going to succeed. So how this um, season going to play out, I don't know. But, but the way they're going, there ain't going to be nobody left by the time she get finished. So, once again, I like this episode, and hey, another good one in the books. <laughs> in the books. In the books. Um, I thought it was a solid episode, super entertaining. I absolutely adored Catwoman and the IV um, part. I thought it was hilarious that she just, like, turned to, like, clay. She's, like, googly-eyed and, like, lost all of her confidence. Mm -hmm. Like, I thought it was adorable to see Ivy in that, because, like you said, it's in such stark contrast to how she usually is. Uh, I just adore that. I thought Catwoman was fantastic, too. Yeah. Um, I loved all of that sequence. Um, it's super adorable with Kite Man and Ivy uh, boot up at the beginning and then her questioning and now they're booed up again. I think mm -hmm. that plays so well, too. Um, and I thought it was hilarious that last segment with uh, Ivy and <laughs> Harley having a heart to heart while she, they're, they're murdering people in the most <laughs> gruesome way people. ever. Yeah. Uh, just so fantastic. The show takes it there and it works every single time, yeah. and I yeah. appreciate that. So I can't wait for the next one. Total solid episode. Yeah. All right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk reaction for Harley Quinn, Season 2, Episode 3. And until next time, people, peace.